A local church putting a twist on traditional church services. Greg Wagner and Karen Weatherholt with Fellowship Baptist Church are here to tell us a little bit about church at the mall. Now, I know this got my attention. I'm right. sure it's getting people's attention at home. <laughs> Talk a little bit about what this means because I'm very intrigued. Well, church at the mall is an opportunity for anybody and everybody to come to a just a safe and different experience. It's outside of the norms and traditional things. Uh, uh, for a Sunday morning church service, anyone who might have apprehensions of entering a building or going and meeting people they don't know, it's just out in the wide open in the mall parking lot and something that's uh, just great for everybody to experience. So this is the Huntington Mall. It's the Huntington your Mall. your church is very close. Correct. You pretty much pass it depending on which way you get to the mall, but that's right. I pass it all the time. Yeah. So talk about how this all came about. How well, did you... It all started Easter of 2020 uh, as a result of the pandemic, a response to that. You know, people during that time, they were feeling lost, uh, disengaged, kind of uh, entrapped there with the confinements and all that. So we're like, hey, let's have something, an opportunity for folks to get uh, out to hear about hope that we have in the resurrection of Jesus Christ. You know, one thing we like about the outdoor service, Jesus came out of the grave. He wasn't inside. And so, you know, we're outside. We're not confined uh, to a structure or a building. So just a way to promote the gospel, the power of Christ, and the power of hope in a human life uh, through any situation. Now, is this weather permitting? Because that's what I'm thinking in my mind. You know, I'm glad you said that because no matter what the weather is, it's permitting. I mean, Whatever the temperature, whatever the conditions are, because uh, our stage is, uh, has a covering over it, you can stay in your car with your heater on if you want. You can get out if you need to, bring blankets. Some have come. We had Boone in here a little bit yeah. ago. People have come with their pets yeah. even. Yeah. So come with your furry yeah. friend uh, to church at the mall. Uh, it's for anyone, everyone, rain or shine, no matter what. We're going to carry on with this service at 1030 a.m. on April the 9th. Okay, so that's for Easter. Right. So are do you do this any other day? Well, we don't do the outdoor thing uh -huh. any other day. We're the other 51 weeks of the year we're in the building. Karen's been in the church since the mid 80s, and so I'd like for her just yeah. to share the What's perspective like? uh, from that uh, side of things. I'm more like I've only been there six years. She's been there and uh, has been engaged with the church. So share how you feel yeah, about what that. Is we enjoy this Sunday yeah. and look forward to it as a church family. Plus, we have people attend that don't normally come to church or won't come to a church building. We've even had people stop that are traveling and attend the service. Yeah. And we've built relationships with the community and people that we might not have met except for the partnership or sponsorship for this event. And really, you know, if someone is kind of intimidated thinking of going into a new church where they don't know anyone, this is another easy way to get them out. And we want to make them all feel comfortable. Yes. And, and where in the parking lot? Because that's what I'm thinking. Where in that mall parking lot? That mall parking lot is kind of... It, the it. food court... The Easter Sunday is the only Sunday every year that the mall's closed. Perfect. So they have been very uh, welcoming to have us set up everything right in front of the food court. So it's the main entrance, I guess, you know, uh, there at the mall. Now, some of the restaurants are still open, so you can uh, patronize there and have dinner after the service. Um, but so it's right in the main parking lot. It's going to be hard to miss us. If you go around the back where the cinemas are and everything, you'll figure it out uh, right there out front. Okay, and talk, let's talk a little bit about how um, everyone can find you. You guys do have a church website. We do. Karen, why don't you share with uh, how folks can get connected to fellowship every other time? Every other time. We have yeah. services at 1030 on every Sunday morning. We have services at 7 p.m. on Wednesday and children's ministry is available at all the, both those services and then online we're at fellowshipbarbersville.com. Okay. Well, I think you guys have a good idea going for um, a different take on Easter Sunday service. So even if it's raining or looks like Drew's going to have the weather cooperate for you guys. Hey, I like <laughs> Thanks, Drew. Like that. Yeah, thanks, Drew. Appreciate you. <laughs> well, thank you both so much. All right.